here I'm playing Dolby level. I didn't touch anything, you see? Levels here, okay. We just switch to the next frequency. Uh, uh, here we go, Dolby level. And ideal results on the output. I believe a little bit low, maybe half decibel low. But still very, very good. And mega ideal face. Wow, it's pretty rare. <laughs> I, I told you, I tune it using my 10 kilohertz, and this is tape is recorded on CR7, I believe it's professional, uh, in South and eBay, and it's, it's ideally matches. It's pretty cool. Now, let me connect generator. to one of the inputs. Let's check recording levels, so zeros, and everything in the middle, it should be recording same level, uh-huh, and it's two decibel lower. Mm -hmm. How much I need? I cannot compensate, you see? It's fully top, and I still cannot compensate, so source. Tape. I minus one decibel, and if I will return to the middle and switch source and tape, it's two and a half decibel difference. That's where adjustments would be needed, and we always adjust this at zero decibel level using these two pots here. some reason I cannot I return this spot back but this is weird so see levels of source minus six and a half decibel tape minus nine I'm trying to adjust I can get to minus Eight, seven and a half. That's the top. So I will not change level. Let's check the bias. So we need to reduce level to minus twenty. And let's switch range. this level left right channel not very balanced so i will be using balance spot uh, to just uh, make them even see. So, source uh -huh, it's cd input that's why bias uh, bias balance it doesn't work. So, okay, let's be switch to the different inputs where we will be using balance spot here. Uh -huh. and levels here are higher <laughs> by five decibel. Uh, now source and tape here we just one decibel drop right 
let's see. Ah, it was 10 kilogears. That's why. Yeah, here. Sorry, guys. Let me. I forget to adjust my generator. Let's go to 400 gears. Let's go to the source. Return levels to zeros. No, a little bit more like that. Okay, zeros. And here we have a little bit of. Ah, uh, now tape 400 steel levels. Two decibel different. But can I adjust now? Yeah, now it works. Here, source tape. Let's be precise. So one channel, source tape. And next, this has a channel. Okay, source tape, source tape. Good. Source tape. Four hundred gears of recording. Perfectly now, and we will have enough range. Now let's see whole range plus three decibel and minus four decibel. Okay, and left plus three and minus four. Okay, they both balance it now. Reduce it level to minus 20. And just in range, you see on these low levels, our port is not same even. Let's just using balance. Okay. okay, source tape. Good. Four hundred gears. We have well. Now I'm going up. One kilogears. Good. 2, 3, 4, 5 kilogears plus 1 decibel, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 plus 1 decibel, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, good, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20 decibel min minus 1, min minus 2 decibel, and perfect recording phase. And it's type one, I remember, remind you. 21, let's start dropping 22. Okay, you see? On all range, it's very linear. And bias is perfect. And now, let's see how our adjustments will go. So level, it shows a little bit off. So on the level, and bias, okay, it shows off. We just check it that bias is there. It's perfect. So we need to adjust indicator position. But now it's in the middle, and now it's uh, balanced between left and right channels. Okay. Let me check uh, instruction service panel how to set those levels. And I will get back to you soon.